With COVID-19, distributing school supplies to students who need them is more challenging this year. Kelo Land News intern Carter Schmidt was in Brookings today to find out how this year will be a lot different from the past. This year's back to school supply drive is a bit different than previous years. Each book bag is packed beforehand and they pick it up through a drive through because of COVID-19, we have to be really cautious about all of the things that we touch and our closeness with everyone. So we're going to have to forego the kids coming in and doing the shopping on their own. This year, the group only accepted monetary donations. Local kids are packing the bags with school supplies, dental supplies, along with a $25 voucher for new shoes. Students in need will be able to pick them up during an event at Faith Reform Church in Brookings. As far as registration goes, and then they're going to get a note on their car window, just like you might get at some of our drive through restaurants now, that will have on that note the school that the child attends, as well as their grade level. And then the stations are divided up by grades. Being able to provide students with the supplies they need to succeed in school is especially important this year. There's individuals that are having challenges financially that never had them before, as well as individuals that maybe are still having challenges from previous years. So we are open to anyone that has a need. There doesn't need to be a proof of income or anything like that. But if you have a need, then make sure that you apply because we'll be happy to help. In Brookings, Carter Schmidt, Kelland News. School supplies will be distributed on August 13th. Families in Brookings County can apply and applications are due by July 31st. You can find application information for the Back to School Project on Kelland.com.